She likes the idea of flying at the limit of a plane's capacities and making a bid for the sound barrier. Jackie Cochran has finally presented her with a new challenge. Will she snatch the title back? Jacqueline makes her double sonic boom at 44,000 feet and joins Jackie's center stage. The first woman to break the sound barrier in America was indeed Jacqueline Cochran, but the first in Europe is Jacqueline Oriol. The French aviator has not broken her rival's speed record, but she loved pulling off the exploit of flying at the speed of sound. What's more, this latest accomplishment means she is finally accepted into the test pilot school. Located near Paris, the CEV, as it's known, is very prestigious. It tests and verifies all civil and military aircraft made in France. Not a single onboard instrument is neglected. The center employs instructors, engineers, researchers, mechanics, and test pilots, all of them men, for the most part, crack aviators. In the center's masculine environment, Jacqueline Oriol does meet one other woman who will become a great friend. Valérie André is at the time a military doctor and one of the few women helicopter pilots. She would save lives during the wars in Algeria and Indochina and become France's first female general. Valérie remembers what Jacqueline told her. To be a test pilot, there is an entry exam, and it is very closely scrutinized. You don't just get in like that. With the registration number 29, Jacqueline Oriol becomes France's first ever woman test pilot and finally joins the prestigious test flight center.